Today we're looking at a two bedroom, two bathroom, Rosa style villa on sea. It's got its own swimming pool, which is a bonus. Where are we? So we're in the southeast of Spain, the Costa Calida, the Murcia region, just out to the lovely town of Mazaron, not far from the port and the beaches. Please check out my playlist, loads of things on there guys. Campasal, it's like a town, we're on set to sea. So we go look at this property, you're going to love it. So as we walk into the front door, we've got the lounge diner, nice big lounge. You got, I'm just going to shut the door a minute. So we got the uh, aircon machine. We also got the ceiling fan. I'll just give you an idea of the size of the room. This end, looking out onto the pool, very nice. So you got a wood fire there. Back into the dining room area. What I've done guys, I haven't put no lights on, so this gives you an idea of the light. We're probably talking about one o'clock now. Where the door is, you've got your fuse box, light switches, obviously control for the air con. So we go into the kitchen, fair size kitchen. And you're probably asking me, What's that? And I can safely say it's not a heater. What it is, it's actually a, 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 a mozzie cum fly thingy. It's like a blue thing. So anything that flies into it gets sapped. Also, you will notice that you've got um, the fire extinguisher blank because this was kitted out for rental. It, this was a rental property at one period. So you've got the oven, hob, We'll show you what's in the oven, nothing in there to eat. Over there is where the water heater is. To show you one of the cupboards. To just give you an idea of the space in there. Plenty of cupboard space. Just give you another quick look back in. Also, if you notice, there's a ceiling fan there. So we go into first bedroom, which will be like the guest or spare bedroom. Got two single beds in here at the moment. Another view out to the pool. Look at that, eh? you can get up in the morning and jump out into your own pool. Just above the bed here, you've got the air con machine and also built in wardrobe. Straight across, we've got First bathroom, got washing machine in there. You've got a walk-in shower, window there to let the light in. Shower unit, just to show you. Some people aren't seeing that. Usual stuff, toilet. You've got an electric heater above the door. So we go into the master bedroom because it's got its own ensuite. So you go into the, the bedroom itself, big space, lovely done out. Now I'm not too sure if this, I would imagine this would come furnished, but ask Finney, he can give you all the information about that. 
Another view of the pool. Just giving an idea what you can see out your window. Plenty of electric points. There's your aircon machine. What you will notice is a, a built-in wardrobe just there. Now, what I didn't show you just then, because it's went past it, you got your more electric points where you, if you wanted to, you could put up your 50 inch telly on this wall, watch telly in bed, you got your phone points. Yeah. As you walk into the bathroom, big fair size, you've got a full size bath, window, there's the uh, shower unit. With bean day, it has its cupboard. Is there anything in the cupboard? We ask ourselves. Yeah. So this is where you would probably put your your Hoover, your broomstick, things like that. Another cupboard up there. There's also another electric heater above the door. Just showing a bit more of the bathroom. Looking back into the uh, the bedroom. So what we do now? We go back outside. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to actually walk from the outside gate into the property, around the property, up the stairs, back around the property. So at the front of the property, we're going through the side gate. It has got parking. And we'll show you that in a minute, just down at the side there. So you can take your car off the road. What we're going to do now, we're going to take your strap onto the sunroof. So we're up onto the sunroof, big space. Now this is obviously just up there where we'd hang your washing up. Or you could put like a pergola, put some shade up. Got a satellite dish. Some people say, what's that? That's the Wi-Fi. And that there is the ladder that goes into the pool. Just give you some view from the area. So you've got plenty of places to walk. Just swing it round. It's a bit of a breeze now. It's uh, mid mid June. Talking in the thirties now. That's looking back towards uh, B and A. So we'll look 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 down onto the uh, the pool. I would jump in that, but I'm not very good at jumping. So there's your dish. So we're gonna go around the property now. Back down the staircase. So what I'll do now, I'll just show you the boring part, which is, well not boring obviously, if you want to take your car off the road, it's pretty important. Is the side garden there. Got some shrubs. Lemon tree for your, uh, your uh, gin and tonic, I should say. So this is uh, the front of the property. It's all been graveled out, so there's hardly any maintenance running, running about weeds and things like that. An entrance to the underbuild. I haven't got the keys for that. I would imagine it probably it's just a small underbuild. So here's the, the gate. Take your car off the road. It goes right back there. Also some steps up to uh, where the pool is so we take you back round to the front where they've got the, uh, the sun porch so you can imagine just sat out here listening to the birdies also got some nice shade there so that's the front door in so here's the it's a full-size pool uh, you, obviously you can walk down into the pool this is what I do you I always explain this to people the shower always shower before you go into the pool washing your oils off here because that will affect the pool the pool you got a, a brolly there but yeah look at that eh? I'll just walk down the other end for you so you got the aircon machines on this side
That's the uh, way you take your car off the road. You've got a pool cover here, which is a good idea. You've got the water pump there, got the electrics for it. So I'll just give you another view of the pool. Got your outside lights as well. And obviously you can't see it now, but it has got pool. It's got lights that light the pool up at night, which looks very nice. Anyway, can't be bad. So I hope you enjoyed the video. So he's looking at a two bedroom, two bathroom, Rosa style villa. If you want any more questions, guys, don't ask me. Ask Vinny from Otherworld Properties. He can give you all the stuff you need to know. Also, don't forget, guys, they've got their own app. Download the app, shows you this property, gives you all the details that you need to know. There will be a description below this video as well, but there'll be more information actually on their site. Also, plenty more properties. I wish I could just jump in there, Paul, but I can't. Anyway, I'll catch you on the next one. As I always say, guys, gotta keep watching.